Hey guys, good morning. This is Keith with KJ Aquatics. I'm just making a quick video um, to just, you know, give a quick explanation on uh, plants that you buy in the hobby, common plants that you buy in the hobby. And uh, when you buy them, they look really good. And then they start to look like crap, which that's what these are doing. But these are actually very healthy plants. Um, these are Amazon swords. Very common in the hobby and often sold, by me included, um, grown immersed. Um, and that's how I bought these. And I, again, I sell them immersed when I usually get them in because that's aesthetically that's their how they look the best. Um, but then when people get them, I'll get um, I'll get messages sometimes, or I see posts from you know other people that bought plants elsewhere on online, and they're they're showing pictures of their plants and they're saying their plants are dying. They just bought them and their plants are dying most of the time the plants aren't dying all they're doing is converting um, and if you don't know a lot of plants that are sold in the hobby are sold in their immersed form nurseries can grow f plants pump out plants much faster growing immersed versus submerged it's a fact it's just part of the business and there's nothing wrong with it um, so don't discount buy any immersed plants just have patience and that goes with any uh that goes with anything in the hobby but planted tanks need patience um regardless of when you buy your plants where you buy your plants you need patience they're not going to look like those beautiful aquascapes instantly that you see online it's just not going to happen all right but anyways back to these plants these are Amazon swords. One of the most common plants in the hobby. Again, these two plants, believe it or not, are extremely healthy. You have the old leaves, leaves that are starting to die back. Um, once they get like this, it's a good idea to, to trim them or you could pinch this off and discard it. Um, but, but once you start to see new young leaves coming from uh from the, the the rosette the base of the plant you could pretty much tell these old leaves to go bye bye same way here these can be trimmed off um because you have nice young healthy leaves coming up there so these believe it or not are extremely healthy plants i have them growing outdoors right now um i was just checking on the tubs this morning and figured let me make a quick video um to you know if you don't know if you're new to the hobby you know i wouldn't ship this out to you because it, it, it's ugly as heck but i would trim these back and this is actually a better plant to buy versus a large immersed grown plant unless you're going to grow it immersed um, and most people i know that buy plants for their aquarium are not buying aquarium true aquarium plants to grow immersed so anyways just thought i'd let you know what an Amazon sword looks like as it's transitioning and try to educate you on actually what a healthy Amazon sword looks like and that's actually a healthy looking plant same way with this so I'll throw these back in the tub and uh, let them keep doing their thing and more than likely, once these get a few more leaves, then I'll put them back on the website. Um, or I'll bring these to uh, club auction or swaps. But um, right now, I probably won't sell this as this. Um, I might, I'll get it, get it a little bit bigger, and then it'll go back on the website. But anyways, guys. 
That's all I got. Peace.